Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying lots of bomb pops for you. Uh, we have the OG, the original bomb pop. We have Nerds. Candy Clash, which is new, and Hawaiian Punch. These were $3.69 a box at Meyer. Um, we have actually- we 12 pops though for that. <laughs> I, I looked it up. Uh, we have reviewed the regular, uh, the um, the Crush, the um, Bomb Pops in the Crush variety, and those were grape, strawberry, and orange flavored, each each one. Yeah, um, each one has three flavors on it. Yes, but we also reviewed, and I had forgotten about these because they were out a couple years ago, and I don't think I've seen them since. They were called Bomb Pop Middles, and they had strawberry, raspberry, taffy was one box, and then you had s'mores was another box, and then another box was chocolate cream. And they were literally called Bomb Pops Middles. If you don't remember, type it in, Tammy Dunn Bomb Pops Middles, and they'll come up. And, and I saw them for that video, but that was it. So, um, don't yeah. Remember them. Uh -uh. Now, well, I remember them once I saw them, but it was like, oh, yeah, those were a thing. And they, they did, they, they must have not gone over well. Now, you think I'll open it like I should? Sure. Oh, look on the side. They have a banana fudge and a watermelon. Huh. Cool. Okay, so I haven't, haven't tried those either. Okay. Should we get... smaller than I remember. Should, should we get our own? Little hands, everything seems I bigger. I know. <laughs> Typically, you give these to your, to your kids, but adults like them too. Now, that's definitely smaller than I remember. I think it is too. Because I don't remember that sucker oh. being that big around. Or, no, they like said, also, at, at Meyer, they also, they had Bomb Pops, but they also had the Popsicle brand yeah, in the yellow Popsicle box. Brand. I wonder if those aren't bigger. I thought Bomb Pops were bigger, too. Mm. It looks bigger on the box. Okay, so these are only 40 calories a piece, or you could eat three for 120 calories. These are made by Wells Enterprises in Iowa. Those are the same people that make um, Blue Bunny ice cream. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Okay, so we should be getting cherry, lime, and blue raspberry. Mm -hmm. That's kind of took a bite off each, off the side of each one. Of that one. The cherry is by far the strongest flavor, but not my favorite. Okay, hold on, don't tell me. I'm not. I want to, I want to see which <clears> one I <throat> think is the best. Hmm, the blue raspberry is not as strong as I thought it would be. I know, it's kind of light. Mm hmm My favorite flavor is the lime. The lime. <laughs> <laughs> it's lime, then cherry, then the blue raspberry is just kind of, eh, it's okay. Yeah, it's, um, honestly, it's all kind of, eh. The cherry's the, the pretty cherry's strong. The cherry's okay, yeah, but it's not a great flavor. It's not a great flavor, cherry, but it's a it's an okay flavor. If you're if it's a hot day and you give it to your kids to run out of the back porch, they're gonna like it. That is not as good as I remember it. No, it it's really not isn't. Good. That is, that it's just, it's not as sweet or something. Um, I thought it was still sweet. I, I just but that not, does not have the flavor that I remember. It's definitely at all. not the flavor that I remembered no. it having. No, I thought it was really sweet and. I know, um, but we've had plenty of bomb pop drinks, you know, the bomb pop kind of drinks. Which are and, better. Which are, got yeah, that, that actually them. tastes better than the bomb pop. Yeah. Hmm, interesting. Do you want me to put that yes, here? Yeah, right there. Go okay. For it. So, okay. So, this is the Nerds. Yeah, it looks like a little mouse. In there. These are all the same calories, all 40 calories per pop. It didn't matter which ones you got. Okay, now this one doesn't have the banana on it, but it does have the watermelon, so that's interesting. Okay, so this one, you yeah, know. Yeah, definitely smaller than I remember. This is tiny. People say shrinkflation. <laughs> um, strawberry, watermelon, and grape. Done. I'm going to be curious every time which one is his favorite. We agree on the first one. The lime was my favorite, too. Um, I didn't really care for that cherry flavor on that first one. It just tasted, it's very like, um, tasted like a cherry lip gloss or something. It just it wasn't that great. What's the what's the strawberry? Sh strawberry, watermelon, and grape. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to have the grape first. 
it's your typical great popsicle. I like the texture of these. They've kind of got that, they're not hard frozen popsicles. Like sometimes you get these popsicles and they're like, you gotta break them. These are softer. Oh wow. And that they have an icy kind of. Strong. Yeah, the green. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it's so funny eating that because we've been eating a lot of watermelon. That's right, real watermelon. Real water, <laughs> yeah, real watermelon. And so it's interesting eating that. It's decent though. It's it's very candy like artificial, but it's still pretty decent. Yeah, but after eating it, the strawberry, you have to really search for the flavor. Yeah, the strawberry, well, I ate the strawberry from first. Mm -hmm. And uh, when I first ate the strawberry, when I thought that was the watermelon at first, <laughs> but it's, it, then you try the watermelon, it's like, oh, that's uh, yeah. definitely strawberry. Um, my favorite, I know my favorite, grape. Oh, well, that's the watermelon. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, I like a good candy fake watermelon. The, sh the strawberry seems the lightest, but I did eat it after nice. the, yeah, I did eat it last. Yeah, the watermelon's um, pretty strong. Because I like grape and I want to eat the grape first. Uh, the watermelon is the strongest one here. Mm -hmm. It's definitely like the overpower, powering flavor here. I think the strawberry is the least flavorful yeah, in here. But I actually like this more than the I original. I like all the flavors, they're better. Okay, that's going to be to see which one is we're going to like the best. So now this one's the new one. You'll have to open another one for you. Picture. Oh, I will. You, you don't you, want that on your picture. No, I'll open another one. Yeah, we'll get a good picture without all these little uh, nibbles. Yeah. Okay, so this one's wow. showing once again the banana and the watermelon. This is the Candy Clash. Blue raspberry, strawberry, and watermelon. So we've had all these flavors already mm -hmm. in different ones. We just had the strawberry and the watermelon, so this will be good to see if they taste exactly the same as what we just had, the strawberry and the watermelon. I'm gonna eat the strawberry first this time because I wanna see if it seem, comes across a stronger. The green is a different green. Yeah, but eat that one last. Oh, okay. Eat the I wanted the strawberry first. Pink, yeah, pink, yeah. blue, and then green. I have to I still say think they're soft. I, I love the texture of these. Mm -hmm, they're, they're like I said, they're some of those popsicles you get and you're like biting through a solid piece of ice on those. I, I <laughs> thought that's how they were as a kid. I thought they were. I almost thought they were a little softer. Oh, no. See, I, I remember it. Maybe I was used to the popsicle brand. Could be the popsicle because I'm sure whatever was cheap. That's what my mom would buy. Yeah, that's so, too. Yeah. The strawberry's not bad if you eat it first. Uh-huh. And I actually like the blue part. Mm-hmm. It's very, very strong. Yeah. But it's good. It's nice and sweet. It's probably the same. I would think it'd be the same. Yeah. Okay. By far the strongest flavor though, I think, is still the watermelon. Mm-hmm. It's, yeah. it's still my favorite flavor. You just don't like that watermelon? Mm -hmm. I don't like it. You know what though? It's very, uh, uh, What's the hard candy? Jolly Rancher. Jolly Rancher. And I was going to say that. You know, it really does taste like, it tastes exactly like a Jolly mm -hmm. Rancher um, watermelon. But I never picked the Jolly Rancher right. watermelon. Right. See, I eat those. I don't eat those. I would eat the cinnamon ones. I like the cherry ones. The grape. The grape ones. Um, I'm not picking the apple <laughs> or the watermelon. Um, so you probably wouldn't pick that one because you'd rather have the grape on the other one. Yes, I would rather have the, what was that one called? The, the Darts? Nerds. Oh, it didn't remind me of Darts necessarily. No, but I mean, I get the it that they're using yeah. those flavors. I get it. Um, I would rather have the Nerds over the Candy Clash. Honestly, I would rather not have one with the watermelon at all. Yeah. So is this one going to have watermelon? No, it's got... This is Hawaiian Punch. Hold on, let's see. Yeah, I would just, it, it almost, it, it does taste very candy watermelon, but, but it almost tastes like the green part of the watermelon. Yeah, see, I like watermelon. Wow, that's a different color green. Oh, it sure is. And it, they're so tiny. Yeah. Hawaiian pet, no wonder they're only 40 calories. Yeah, You're small. not getting any food. Yeah. Uh, is this, would you really consider this a food? No, it's, a, it's just a sweet treat. Uh, this is Orange Ocean. Fruit Juicy Red and Green Berry Rush. So, Green Berry, it looks, they're showing a picture of a kiwi. Mm -hmm. They're showing pictures of pineapple, oh, apple, strawberry, 
uh, orange and kiwi is what they're showing on here. You know, that box looks like they're mixed up. Like the red and the orange are switched. Oh, like you get, are the, all the boxes like that? No. No, the other no. ones. No, but you're right. They're showing some with red at the top and some with orange at the top. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, is you can't see through them, so you don't know. Yeah, okay. Oh, no. It's the same. It's the same, yeah. Huh. Yeah. All right. Okay, so. Let's see if I like this one better. Which, I think I would start the green. I was going to say, do you have a suggestion? I would start the green and work your way up. I can't tell what the green is. It does kind of have a kiwi kind of flavor. It has a kiwi kind of earthy flavor. Yeah, it's not bad though. I don't mind, I don't mind it at all. The orange was really nice. It had a nice orange flavor. Mm. Mm -hmm. And that orange makes me want one of those Flintstones push up pop, push pops. <laughs> those are good. I love those things. They, they used to sell those at school. You know, when you could go back and get extra, you could get a jello pudding pop or you could get an extra cookie. They would have push pops too. Yeah. You could get for like a quarter a piece. At school. And the red's like a like a fruit punch, I guess. It's uh -huh. not very it's not very strong like a fruit punch, but it's got that that flavor. That one's actually I think I kinda like that one the best um, of all of them. I do too. Yeah. I like the uh, my favorite flavor out of all the flavors is probably the the uh, the orange, orange yeah. out of out of all the boxes. And then the next flavor that I like the best it's either the fruit punch or the grape. Yeah, see, I like the watermelon probably next, but then the, then everything else would be on the, the Hawaiian punch one. Mm -hmm. I, um, um, I've never thought, honestly, reviewing all the candy, all the, the, the kid stuff. I've never thought, um, doing one of these reviews, that I've outgrown something. Mm -hmm. I think I've outgrown these. This is something that I genuinely um it's okay but i could never have one again in my whole life and be fine with yeah. it i just think i've outgrown these it's not as enjoyable to me it, it, I, it was very enjoyable as a child the original bomb pop this this it was not as enjoyable to me as far as all the flavors and stuff like that it's just um it did it doesn't hit me the same way that it used to so for me i personally wouldn't buy any of them I think these would be good if I think. Well, these are geared towards buying. I think kids, they have usually. their place. I yeah. think kids will like them. And and if the kids have got one and you grab one, I think you'll you'll enjoy it. Especially mm -hmm. if you're outside running around playing with the kids, you'll enjoy a nice cool treat. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm like you. I don't think I would ever buy these separate. No. And, there are other yeah. frozen treats I would rather buy. Yes, as an adult, there's so much more that has more flavor yeah. or or just uh, just sherbet. We love just. Yeah. Uh, just sherbet is, is absolutely phenomenal and it has so much flavor and it's so cold and and mm -hmm. just wonderful and it's great on a hot day that i'm not going to choose one of these no. where it's just so um i don't know it's artificial and it's I, very artificial. I did not care for that cherry and that original bomb pop no, after I all agree. these years and but but i mean the flavors are definitely there. They're, they definitely all have flavor, so you're not. It's like not eating ice, you know. It, it's, no, it's actually flavored. So if you had to choose a box, the Hawaiian. I think I'm gonna go with the Hawaiian punch no. too. Out of all these, I think I I'm would do go that, with that one, one and probably yeah. the um, the one with the grape, the the nerds. I would probably right. nerd second if I if I had to pick a second one. That's what I would mm -hmm. do. Yeah, now I would be up for trying the banana and the watermelon if we saw them. Although it's watermelon, you would it's going to be the same. It's going to be the same thing. It's so just there's, one whole so there's no point. But yeah. it is interesting that they don't have. Um, I would like to see like a pina colada. Like I would like to see a coconut and banana. Or a tropical. Like a tropical. Call it tropical. Yeah, yeah, that would be more I think up my alley if if they had something with those with. Flavors that you know what they're gonna do in that though, they're what? gonna stick a mango and a passion fruit in there. No, I don't want ruin. mango, it's gonna ruin fruit. it. <laughs> I want some rum, you want pineapple. I want rum, they're not gonna put rum and in the coconut and pineapple. That's what I want in mine. Make an adult bomb pop. That's what the liquor store they do have adult frozen stuff, at liquor store. yeah, but not a bomb 
bottle pop. No. Not a bottle pop. They need to make adult bomb pops. Can you imagine going to a fun party out on a boat or whatever and having adult bomb pops? They could literally still sell them as bomb pops and just have them with alcohol. That would be fun. Uh, but anyway, I will have a picture for you at the end. I hope you enjoyed the video. We really appreciate you watching and we'll see you next time.